you so much. It's a pleasure that we're organizing uh, this the ICC, having the ICC Arbitration Court event in Egypt marks a new era for arbitration in Egypt and I would say the region because having this, we've had previously of course ICC conferences but the first ICC Court Arbitration Day I think marks that Egypt remains a hub for doing business and for resolving disputes and that um, Egyptian um, law, Egyptian courts and Cairo and other cities are uh, well equipped to be proper seats for international arbitration not just domestically regionally and internationally. I think this signals, as we've heard today, the Secretary General of the ICC Court talking about the statistics, it shows that Egyptian parties are very active in arbitrations in ICC. So it is befitting to organize this first day, which we hope many more will come. So it signals a very strong message that we have a very vibrant and active arbitration community in Egypt. The attendees and whoever will be seeing that online have seen the quality of the judges, superb quality of the attendees, again, superb. We are the exports of the legal industry in the Middle East. So this is what we will be, this is what will be shown in, through this event. It is a very important event because it is the first, it's the first ICC court arbitration day in the region and it's uh, uh, very significant that it is happening in Cairo, Egypt. Uh, because uh, uh, this recognizes uh, the arbitration and the uh, community and the expertise that exists in Egypt. And I think that um, Egypt is uh, one of the pillar jurisdictions when it comes to uh, legal savviness. Uh, and hosting an event like this in Egypt not only gives back to the community, but also pushes the conversation forward as to the development of the ecosystem of arbitration specifically, but law in general. So hosting this event here was monumental in the strategic development of the ICC activities uh, around the Middle East.